Hello kids welcome to the maths class Today we will do a new topic that is comparison of numbers The main objective of today's learning is to understand how to find out the smallest and the greatest number Now let's learn how to find out the smallest number The question is circle the smallest number the numbers are 76 44 30 89 our first step is to write down the place value chart so we will write one sentence on all the numbers now we will underline the first number that is 7 4 3 8 among all which one is the smallest 3 so 30 is the answer and we will circle it let us practice some more examples of how to find out the smallest number now read the statement carefully with me circle the smallest number now first we will find out the smallest number then we have to circle it so let us read the numbers first 23 94 18 65 now whenever we have to find out the smallest number our first step is to write down the place value chart so we will write the place value chart first ones tens ones ten ones tens ones tens now we will underline the first number 2 9 1 6 now among all the numbers which one is the smallest 2 9 1 6 1 it means 18 is the smallest number so we will circle 18 clear now let us do an another example the numbers are Seven hundred eighteen, two hundred, five hundred thirty-six, nine hundred twenty. Again, our first step is to write down the place value chart. So first, we will write down the place value chart. That is, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens. Hundred, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, hundred. Okay. Now again we will underline the first digit. Seven, two, five, nine. Now among all. Tell me which one is the smallest one? Seven? No. Five? No. Nine? No. Two? Yes. So two hundred is the smallest number. So we will circle two hundred. Now another example is. Three hundred sixty-three, three hundred forty-six, three hundred ten, three hundred eighty-two. Again, we have to find out the smallest number. So first, we will write down the place value chart. That is, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens. Hundred, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, 
100. Now again we will underline the first number. 3, 3, 3, 3. Now here all numbers are same. All numbers are 3. So we will underline now the second number. That is 6, 4, 1, 8. Now among 6, 4, 1, 8. Which one is the smallest? 1. It means 310 is the smallest number. So we will circle 310. Clear? Let us learn how to find out the greatest number. The question is circle the greatest number. And the numbers are 23, 18, 54, 98. Now our first step is to write down the place value chart. So we will write one sentence on all the numbers. Now we will underline the first number that is 2, 1, 5, 9. Now among all which one is the greatest? 9. So, 98 is the greatest number and we will circle it. Let us practice some more examples of how to find out the greatest number. Now, read the statement with me. Tick the greatest number. Now, here we will find out the greatest number first and then we will tick it. Again, let us read the numbers very carefully. 43, 27, 96, 85. Again, our first step is to write down the place value chart. So, first we will write down the place value chart on all the numbers. 1s, 10s, 1s, 10s, 1s. 10s, 1s, 10s. Clear? Now again we will underline the first number. 4, 2, 9, 8. Now among 4, 2, 9, 8, which one is the greatest one? 9. So 96 is the greatest number. So we will tick 96. Now let us read an another example. The numbers are 682, 723, 112, 569. Now again our first step is to write down the place value chart. So we will write the place value chart. 1s, 10s. Hundred, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, hundred. Clear? Now, which is our second step? Our second step is to underline the first number. Six, seven, one. 5. Now among all, which one is the greatest one? 6? No. 1? No. 5? No. 7? Seven. 7 is the greatest one. It means 723 is the greatest number. So we will tick 723. Clear? Now let us do one more example. 890, 874, 826, 802. Now again our first step is to write down the place value chart. So first we will write the place value chart. 1s, 10s, 100. 1s, 10s, 100. 1s. Tens, hundred, ones, tens, 
100. Now again we will underline the first number. 8, 8, 8, 8. Oh, now all numbers are again same. So we will underline the second number. 9, 7, 2, 0. Now among 9, 7, 2, 0, which one is the greatest one? 9. It means 890 is the greatest number. So we will tick 890. Now let us compare the numbers. Put sign greater than or equals to. Now we have to put the sign on the number which one is the greatest one. So number one is 764. 292. Again, before finding it, our first step is to write down the place value chart. So we will write ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, hundred. Now again, we will underline the first number seven, two. Now, which one is the greatest one? 7 or 2? 7. It means 764 is the greatest number. So, we will put greater than sign on this side. Clear? Now, next is 315. 315. Again, we will write the place value well, chart. Ones, tens, hundred, ones, tens, hundred. Now, three is here. Three, one, one, five, five. Both numbers are same. On both sides, 315 is written. So, we will put the sign of equals to here. Okay. We will put equals to sign where both numbers are equal. Now, next is 501, 861. Again, first we will write down the place value chart that is ones, tens, hundred, ones tens hundred now again five eight now which one is the greatest one eight means eight hundred sixty one is the greatest number so we will put greater than sign on this side let us recall what we have learned today in this video we have learned how to find out the smallest number, greatest number and how to compare the numbers. For that, read the numbers carefully. Then write the place value chart on the numbers. And then mark the smallest and the greatest number. Now I hope children you all have understood the topic. So open your snap homework and do your work.